Okay, folks. Here we have two uh, Monster Apocalypse unit boosters. Uh, these will contain four random small units and one random building. Uh, they also sell uh, monster boosters and those would contain one random monster and its corresponding uh, hyper form. Uh, those would be in a green box and labeled as uh, monster boosters. Okay, so these are our unit boosters and they retail for uh, $12.99. And uh, let's open these up. Okay. Oh, look at this. Another clear plastic air filled spacer. What a waste. Uh, okay, well, uh, you really don't get a lot with uh, Monster Apocalypse. Okay. I've got this, uh, this building with a uh, smoke colored uh, glass instead of the blue from the starter. Units, we've got four units here. Some dinosaur looking thing. Oh, what is this? Uh, another creepy crawly insect thing. Another uh, little I don't know if it's a dinosaur or an insect. And I have no idea what this is. This is some kind of alien contraption. Okay, so that's what came in this first booster. I'll open up the second. Okay, another stupid air-filled spacer. You know, they really could reduce the size of the boxes and just put the things in there snugly. And uh, such a waste of packaging. Okay. We have a, a Cthulhu creature. I think this is a Taskmaster or something. Uh... Okay, the building included in here is odd. It looks like a uh, looks like a nuclear reactor building. Okay, we've got a guard G tank, robotic tank thing. Oops, sorry about that. And we've got another G tank. Okay, is that everything in there? Oh, okay, and we've got another one of these weird either dinosaur or insect looking guys. Okay, so I'm gonna take these out of the plastic and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. And uh, I've unwrapped them out of their plastic. And here's what I got in the uh, two boosters. Uh, this is what I got in the first booster, and this is what I got in the second one. Okay, you can see the buildings. In the first booster I got what's uh, called a TV network high-rise, and in the second booster I got a nuclear power plant. <laughs> it has a little sludge nuclear waste rubble marker. This one has its own uh, rubble marker. 
looks like it's on fire. And here are the units that came in the boosters. Like I said, I, in my opinion, you don't really get a lot for your money. I mean, you know, twelve ninety nine for this. You know, another twelve ninety nine for this. You don't get a lot. I mean, they really should have added a few more pieces in each booster. Okay, in the first booster, we've got, uh, in this front corner, we've got what's called a Belcher. Uh, this is a Raptix. In the back is a uh, Destructomite. And this alien device here is a Shadow Gate. Okay, here we go. And uh, we've got another Belcher. Uh, we've got a Taskmaster. A G-Tank. And in the back is an Elite G-Tank. All right. Uh, now, just uh, if you wanted to know a little bit about how to compose an army in this game, uh, you pick your one big monster, and then uh, you can add up to 15 of these small units of your choice. Uh, of those 15, five can be Elite units. Uh, each booster will have one Elite unit. The Elite unit, uh, you could tell their name is in red here. So in this booster, the elite unit is the uh, Raptix. And in, oh, <laughs> this booster actually came with two elite units. Uh, the Taskmaster is an elite unit, and this, uh, this G-Tank is an elite unit. Ah, so I lucked out there. So yeah, you can add fif up to 15 of these units to go with your big monster. And besides that, you want to add up to uh, 12 buildings that you can add to the map. And they, they, you know, they add some gameplay elements overall. So that's what you get, and uh, I'll have some still picks after this.